Hello everyone. Hope you had a great long weekend. Um, Sarah and I today on our weekly report wanted to talk a little bit about a strategy that we have been um, you know, introducing to our clients as well, being winter. I know we speak about it a lot, um, that you know, still list now, things always sell, whether it be winter or spring, but that's actually a true fact. We're actually contacting vendors, you know, that are thinking about listing their properties in spring and calling them, you know, to say, why list your property then? Why not list it now? So, um, because there is less competition in the winter market. And, you know, it's proven, and Sarah can go through it shortly with you as well, about the offers and that that we have been receiving in winter. Like, and, you know, last winter, I think, was our busiest month we had in the entire year was our winter month. So mm. it is um, a really good thing to think about. You know, some food for thought is why would you want to list your property in spring when you've also got so many other properties listed for sale? So, and you know, you've got a lot more competition. So something to think about and a strategy yeah. that we are using um, a lot with, you know, clients at the moment as well. Yeah, definitely. So we've had a number of vendors contact us over the last few weeks or we've contacted them and we've had a chat about when's the right time to sell and the right time to sell is always when you're ready and um, at the moment we have been listing properties and then contracting properties um, very quickly so yes. just um, for example we've had two in the last week that have been list the market yep yep and then contracted within the first week so Things are, uh, things are going great in the market and we encourage you to contact us and talk to us further about that. Yes. Uh, we've got some exciting listings um, coming up later in the month and also um, that are hitting the market this week. We have put a sneak peek up last week yep. um, on 3 Aramanta Drive. Yes. And so if you're interested in that property, I suggest <laughs> you call us because we have had that many um, private inspections already organised. Um, and it's got its first open on this coming Saturday. Saturday, yeah. So um, yes, that will not be here for long. That's so right. do and call us. That's right. And um, 11 Kai Wong Court, uh, mm. amazing interest in this property. It's nine foot ceilings, one owner, double, well it's- um, Massive. Yeah, double stone house. Yep. It's amazing. So um, that I actually had someone come through on the weekend and he was like, this is amazing. So um, yep. definitely give us a call and have a look at these properties. They're not gonna last long. Yep. So it opens on the weekend as well? Opens, yeah. I had five opens on the weekend and some private inspections. Over the opens, I had 12 people. Um, and yeah, it was it was great to talk to some people. I met some lovely people and showed some people that are very interested in, in these houses as well. So yeah. it was good. Uh, so yeah. it's sort of a bit of a deep report today, but we just wanted to you know share our expertise with you um, and give you our thoughts um, as well on the market. So we have some exciting things happening this week as well, so stay tuned for that we've got, we've got the photo shoot tomorrow oh we do we've got a photo shoot can we talk about that i don't know we're gonna we're having photo shoot with our with our animals yeah and my puppy is so cute like bella is cute yeah yummy is very cute yeah. so anyway we've got lots of really photos. exciting things happening so yep. stay tuned um and yes definitely if you're thinking about selling come and talk to us because there yep. is no perfect time to sell yep thank you thank you